Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how I made this badge holder for my badges. Um, okay, we're going to go to images, type in rectangle, so you can see all the rec rectangle shapes and colors. Okay, you could choose whatever you like here. I bought this one, I believe it was 99 cents. Okay, you're gonna go ahead and unlock this this little lock up here, and you're gonna make it 3.1 by 4.5. Sorry about that, 4.5. Okay. Now you're gonna ungroup so you could get those two layers separated. This one, the you're gonna it's gonna be the outer border. So you make it whatever color you you like. I'm gonna do it black. On this one, you make it as big as you want. It's up to you, whatever you know shape you like, size. So I'm just gonna select all and try to put it in the middle. Right there then to have this one with the pattern you will need to change it to a print and cut so you click on standard click on the box pattern and by here you you choose any pattern you like you can make different ones you know different card holders depending on your badges so it could match your badges let me see there's a heart okay right here it's the heart right now then you select all, attach, and you start right here. You start putting your your pictures, your writing, your logo, your code. So let me unplan this one so you can see. Okay, if it goes behind it like that, just click on the rectangle and click on send to back, and it will just come to the front. Okay. I have all my info right here. Right here, I'm gonna select all. Oops, no, select all and flatten because I just want this printed and cutting only the outline, the outside. Nothing's gonna cut inside because I flatten it, so it's just gonna cut the outside. And then I got my little rectangle right here. I got that one from the shapes. Unlock it and then you go ahead and do it any size you want. On this one, you, you don't you don't flatten it with this because then it's not gonna cut it. So in this case, you're gonna just put it where you want, grab everything, and then you're gonna attach it. That way. This will cut and this will cut. Okay, so we're gonna send it to make it. If you want four or the same design, just put four and apply. Continue. Okay, I'm gonna act like I, I already printed it. My settings are photo paper, and I always put more right now because my blade is. Has been used you know more than a couple of times so it's not that sharp but if you have a sharp blade then you either use default or less because it's a very very sharp and that's it that's how I make my badge cards now if you don't want to buy the rectangle you could always let me put this aside you could always use the shapes here they're a little bit different they're not rounded like this one right here say this one right here it's more make it to the size 3.1 to 4.5 and then you're gonna duplicate okay this one we're gonna do it black and this one we're gonna put it in the front and just make it, you know, any size you like. 
align it to the center and then we're going to click on this one same thing print and cut pattern <clears throat> it's a little bit different but you know it still works it looks good i think it looks good and then you grab everything and attach and then again you start putting again right here you just send it back so the picture will come to the front and you start adding your stuff so remember what whatever you don't want cut you know stays inside and you flatten it this one you want cut again send it back so you just grab everything and attach same thing make it you want four apply there you have your four and it's gonna be the same settings so yeah so it's you know it's it's the same it looks a little bit different from the outer rounded edges but you know it still looks nice I think so but yeah that's how I do my badges my badge holders and I hope you enjoyed it. and if you have any questions just put them down in the comments if you have any suggestions please you know I'm I'm all ears for any you know anything you want to share that I could do differently or faster or whatever I can do better so yeah thank you and um, have a good day